What's up my bros, it's Big Bro right here and I'm back with another episode of FIFA 22 PSG Career Mode and remember in the last episode we managed to draw against Stade Brestois and we also managed to beat Stade Reims but that's not the only thing we did we also managed to sell Paredes for Axel Witzel and if you're looking at the lineup right now you're seeing something that's a little bit different Messi is no longer in the right wing formation now he is currently a camp because his development plan has finally gotten up to date as you can see the plus four there and right now is a camp but Axel Witzel he is a CDM but that exclamation mark is there because he's supposed to be a central midfielder in this position so right now I'm gonna go to the squad hub and I'm gonna see if I can make Axel Witzel a central midfielder because you know I'm trying to see if I can make my players in their best formation. So let me look at the development plan. I'm trying to see if I can make Axelvito be in his best formation and in his best self. So let me see now. It'll take 34 weeks. That's not too long. Frame being in a central midfielder, that's not too long. But we'll just have to stomach him being you know, in the wrong position as of right now. But that doesn't really matter. We have a game up against Clermont and it's happening right now. So let's look at the lineups for both clubs. We are rocking a 4-3-3 attack and now with Jimmy Vardy, Grealish, Di Maria, Messi, Witzel, Verratti, Lucadinie, Ramos, Marquinhos, Hakimi, and Donnarama. And then Kermant is rocking a 4-2-3 on wide, Bayo, Bethamir, Dosu, Karen, Manjanin, Ogier, Nsimba, and Desmas. We got to win against Kermans because right now currently we're in the third place of the Ligue 1 standings. We can't keep on going down and down and obviously it's not because we lost a game. It's because the weeks that I simulated we had no games and other clubs had an advantage of playing games which made them go up in the standings. So now we need to defeat Kermans. He actually hits uh, the newest transfer right now for PSG because remember the transfer window has been closed it's September already and we can't afford to Kermont we're currently in the third place of the Liga 1 standings and right now we have to make sure that we have to go up more in the ranks man we can't keep on falling down the ranks because remember like it's not really our fault these recent weeks we haven't played any type of match or any type of game so all these other clubs have the opportunity to move up the rankings so right now we need to make sure that we win this game we need to make sure that we win this match right now trying to see if I can Jamie Vardy and Jack Grealish a shot with Axel Witzel remember Lionel Messi dropping a new cam formation so let's see what that does for us man you should never underestimate a club or any type of team in any type of sport bro because you never know what the fuck could happen because now look we cannot climb on just Running up the left flank. Now Sergio Ramos had to get it out of there, but now that didn't work. Ooh. Di Maria, how do you just get robbed like that, man? Clermont. Clermont, come on. Ooh, how do you break through all those players? Come on, get out of there without conceding a penalty. Oh, shit. The 10th minute and they score. How did they break through all of my defense? What's going on? against Clermont man what's going on against Clermont you can hear the boots and look what the fuck Donnarama didn't even have any chance to save that wow that, that, that's just horrible man that's just horrible from us man Di Maria Di Maria looking for Axel Witzel Messi Messi ah uh, Jamie Vardy come on steal it oh uh, oh uh. Messi has the ball again. That's for Axel Witzel. Axel Witzel for Hakimi. Hakimi for Jimmy Vardy. Oh my God, man. The Clement defense is really looking good, man. I haven't gone live. The defense is looking really good, man. Oh shit. And their offense is good as fuck too. Oh no. No! 2-0 down! How? How, bro? 2-0 down against Clermont. What's PSG doing? 
What the fuck, man? I'm sorry, there's no PSG without Mbappe, bro. For real, Mbappe, he's an attacking force that helps helps actually run and find moves, man. That's a bad pass for me, man. What's going on? We're 2 0 down against Kodermond. Oh, shit. What Danarama doing? Go away, Danarama. Damn. Fuck. Jimmy Vardy. Run fast. Why'd you turn around, Jamie Vardy? Oh my god. Pass it to Axel Vitzel. Axel Vitzel Vitzel find Messi. Then Messi. Oh my god. How'd he get deflected, man? Come on. 34th minute. What the fuck? 34th minute, man. Oh, man. Come on. Now, another corner. 32nd minute, man. We're gonna take a fat L. Oh my god, Nox and Witzel. Finding Verratti. Come on, Di Maria! Man, come on! What's going on? Now, another corner. See if we can actually score this time. Come on, man! After Witzel almost had his first goal, man. Come on. Come on, these guys are not doing good. Hold up, I need to make two subs, man. I need to make two subs. I need more attack and play. I need just more, man. Now I need to move Jimmy Vardy for Mbappe. I need to move Grealish for Neymar. I need to do this, man. This is what I need to do right now, bro, because this shit is not looking good, man. This shit is not looking good, bro. What the fuck? We were already 2 0 down against Clermont. What the fuck? Where are you, the people that become, you know, up the score, you know? Oh my god. Clermont, what are these niggas, man? A foul? What do you mean, man? Oh. Uh, two subs for Mbappe and Neymar coming up. Damn, PSG is looking really bad this match, man. They were looking really horrible right now. Oh shit, I almost went in, man. Tried the keeper, man. Now Ramos passing it for Hakimi. Hakimi for Axel Witzel. Axel Witzel for Messi. Messi looking for Mbappe. Oh, that's, that's a bad pass for me. Now nah, Mbappe. Oh my God. Now nah, come on, head it in. Oh my God. Oh fuck, that's the last play of the game. We could have fucking at least made it two one, man. But we didn't even do nothing, man. What's go what the fuck is going on, man? I don't know, man. We need to actually just find a way to just tie this game. We need to find a way to tie this. Kermont is just playing really good, man. Playing really good. How are they better than PSG right now? But that's how you know you should never underestimate a club. Verratti to Mbappe. Back to Messi. Messi seeing Mbappe. Mbappe. Oh, um, penalty. What the fuck? How did he stop that play? That play was nice, man. Oh, how are we 2-0 down against Clermont? This is so bad right now. We're having a lot of chances, but we're not even capitalizing on anything. Not capitalizing on shit. Uh, pass it to Neymar. Let me see. If... Oh, oh my God. That was horrible. Horrible. This whole game is just horrible. This whole game is just horrible, man. Messi pass it to Mbappe. Bappe for Neymar. Neymar must just stop right there. Nobody's trying to even do something. Come Axel Vito, his first goal. Axel Vito's first goal in a PSG kit. Man, that's a good start for a new transferee. Look at this. Neymar just finds Mbappe. Mbappe finds Axel Vito. Axel Vito just shoots it on the first touch. Right now, we're currently 2 0 down against. Clermont, but this goal made it now 2-1. We 
we finally have a fighting chance to get back into the game boy i think it's a little bit too late because it's the 77th minute but this is a good start for axel vitzel man a good first game for axel vitzel and in terms of him actually start scoring a goal not of him being on a winning team we need to find a way to keep on scoring goals make it at least two all now Mbappe, his strength of Mbappe, pass it to Neymar, uh, it's a little bit way too wide. Let's we'll see if Neymar can do something. Ah, uh, Verratti in the middle, but he didn't get it. Look at Dini trying to get it, but no, now it's 81st minute, man. We can't concede another goal. Oh, oh shit. Yeah, it might be the perfect counter attack. Look at Dini, come on. Come on, look at Dini. Ooh, that was way too close. Look at the helps us recover with the help of Sergio Ramos. Now Neymar. Let's see if Mbappe makes a run. Mbappe. Oh! Mbappe! Oh, I thought the goalie was about to deflect that shit. But Ken Mbappe helps us become 2 all against Kerman. What the fuck? I thought this shit was about to be deflected. Look at killing Mbappe. How did he get that? How did he get that? This nigga is a fucking android. This nigga is not human. I thought the goalie would just deflect that shit. This nigga killing Mbappe helps us at least make it a tie. Helps us at least make it a draw. So if we score another goal, we can have a fighting chance of actually winning this game, man. Fuck. Bro, this whole game, I was just down. I was mad. I was down and mad that we were performing terribly. But right now, we're looking good right now, man. We're looking good. Two minutes until stoppage time. Let's at least make it just a draw. Let's at least make it just a draw, man. Oh, shit. That might not happen. That might not happen. Come on. Oh, we got the ball. Now, look at Dini. Passes it, just passes away. Two all against Clermont. This was a bad performance at the first half, but the second half, literally the end of the second half, we just managed to scrape a draw. We managed to scrape a tie, but that doesn't really matter right now. Axel Witzel has his first ever goal in a PSG shirt in this career mode season. That's all I'm mad right now. Axel Witzel just newly got hired to PSG, has his first ever goal. Look at him right now on the goal scoring sheet. Wow. I'm not gonna do the post match interview, man. That just advanced, man. Damn. Oh my god. That was that was hectic, man. I haven't gonna lie. That shit was hectic as fuck, man. Axel Witzel and Mbappe help to save us now i think the champions league is coming on its way we are in the champions league it was a right now this is good for us now we're going to be facing man city in the champions league let's look at the standings before we even do anything right now we're in group a man city psg rp leipzig and club brugge we need to beat Man City. We need to find a way to defeat Man City, man. It's going to be tough. Man City is not a club to underestimate, man. But now in Group B, Atletico, Liverpool, Porto, AC Milan, Group C, Sporting, Borussia Dortmund, Ajax, and Besticas. Group D, Inter Milan, Real Madrid, Shakhtar, and I don't know how you say that, Kravosi, Krasovica? I don't know how you say that. And Group E, Bayern, Barcelona, Benfica, and Dynamo Kiev. Group F, Villarreal, Man United, Bergamo, and Young Boys. Group G, Lille, Sevilla, Salzburg, and Wolfsburg. Group H, Chelsea, Piamonte Calcio, Malmo, Cognasa, Port. I don't know how you say that too. Man, we made it to Champions League, but man, that last game was very tough, man. But now let's attend the press conference for the Champions League. This is something that we need to attend. We need to attend the press conference for the Champions League. Oh, actually, Victor and Mbappe really saved me in that last game, man. But now let's see the question they have for us. It'll be tough. There are plenty of good teams around, but you must be confident. Does your team have what it takes to win the UFA Champions League? I'll just say this group of players can definitely win man we can definitely hold it down we have the three times mbappe neymar messi we also have new signs like axel vitzel jack grealish we have substitutes like di maria and all that shit so let's see what the reporter's asking can you kick it off with a win i'll say 
I'll say we'll have to see how we match up, you know, because remember, you can't underestimate any other club, any other sport. You can't do that, man. That's just bad for you. Let's see what the reporter asks. Man City versus PSG is like a pretty even contest on paper. I'm sure you've got a plan to win the game. I'll say we won't underestimate Man City. Never underestimate Man City. Do not underestimate any other club. That's what you should never ever do, man. Before I even go against Man City, I need to do this. I need to move Jim Vardy and Grealish because I need my top people right now. I need them right now. So Mbappe will come. Grealish will come off for Neymar. Um, Van Adam, since he's a central mid, I need somebody who's actually a central mid. At the victor, I'll put him in the game. You know, I'll substitute him in the game later in the game, but I'll see. You know, I'm, I'm not making any promises. But now, let's go to the lineup for Man City taking on PSG. Let's look at the lineup. So we have Gabriel Jesus, Raheem Sterling, Marez, Gundogan, Kevin De Bruyne, Rodri, Diaz, Stones, Joao Cancelo. Hopefully that's not Joao Cancelo. Katerbach and Ederson. And now for our team, you know, 4-3-3 attack. Mbappe, Neymar, Di Maria, Messi, Verratti, Van Adam, Luca Dini, Sergio Ramos, Marquinhos, Hakimi, and Donnarama. This is the first game of the Champions League against Man City. We have to win this game. We can't slack in this game. We need to make sure that we need to win this game. I don't give a damn. Now let's start this game, man. Now is the first game of the Champions League against Man City. This is a very, very important game. Not only are we taking on one of the best clubs, I would say in the world right now is Man City. This is the first game of the Champions League. We have to win this game in order to show our dominance. Because right now, the only two leagues that I'm taking seriously are League A1 and the Champions League. All the other leagues like the, you know, the FA Cup and all the other cups, I will win those as well. But the Champions League and League One, I'm taking these ones very, very serious, man. This is not a game to look slightly, man. As you can see, the camera angle has been a little bit different, man, because the broadcast angle, you know, I was using it for a fat minute, but I ain't gonna lie, it was like the runs and the plays I tried to do, I couldn't really see it, you know, but that doesn't matter right now. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Donnarama saved us, man. Donnarama saved us, man. Now it was a first corner for PSG. I mean, for Man City. Get the ball out of there. Pass it to Neymar. You can come at the counter attack. Neymar just run. 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 Neymar and he scores. Neymar just running. He didn't give up. And then he scored, man. Thank God to Neymar, man. Neymar Jr. Making us have the first goal in the Champions League right now. This is a group stage. Neymar just did not stop running. He just, he was probably thinking of squaring it to somebody, but he knew that that probably wouldn't even work, man. It probably could have worked, but it didn't even work, man. But that doesn't matter. We are 1 0 up against Man City. We need to find a way to keep this goal margin up because Man City are not a game. They are not a club to underestimate, man. You know what I mean? So now Kevin De Bruyne has the ball. Kevin De Bruyne passes to Marez. Marez come on the right flank. Sergio Ramos gets the ball out of there. Just too massive to, you know, to look past. Now Kevin De Bruyne taking the corner. Taking the corner. Now Donnarama just saves that. Donnarama saves that. Now Man City. Oh my god, Man City. Come on. Oh, Sergio Ramos. Come on. Ooh, Marez. Marez. Ooh. Kevin De Bruyne. Kevin De Bruyne. Oh, Kevin De Bruyne. Ooh, trying to psych me out. Oh, man, that was too close, man. Oh, no, they got the ball back. Got the ball back, man. Man City just keep on applying the pressure. Man City keep on applying the pressure, man. Ooh, we got the, finally got the ball back. But that was way too close. Wait, Ramos is hurt. Sergio Ramos is hurt? Oh, no. Sergio Ramos is hurt. 
Oh my god, I'll start to sub him off. I'll start to sub up Jojo Ramos. Right now. Doesn't matter right now. Neymar. Neymar, trying to see you. Oh, that was a bad cross. Let me sub off Ramos right now. Ramos is injured. What? He's injured right now. Ooh. I gotta sub him off for Kempembe. That might fuck me up. Because Ramos, his strength, man. His strength is really good, man. At the back four. For real, for real. Well, hopefully, Ramos is okay, man. He has the injury, man. Hopefully, he's okay. Come on, get the ball out of there. Come on. Oh, shit. Oh, we just barely got the ball. You can see, Sergio Ramos just does good for us, man. But now, Mbappe by himself. Come on, Mbappe by himself. Come on, shoot it. And he scores. 2 0 up. Against Man City in the Champions League, killing Mbappe just super kicks that goal, penalty, whatever that corner kick post, super kicks it away. Now we are two nil up against Man City, man. Killing Mbappe just tracking a goalie, running straight towards Ederson, but make sure that Ederson barely tries to touch the ball but it doesn't matter the ball is at the back of the net but now ramos i need to remove him for kimpembe because ramos man he's looking a little bit hurt man that injury he picked up man Ooh, now vanaldo passed it to varati varati passed it to neymar oh they saw the playoffs trying to do oh now look at dine oh passing it back come on look at dine you can't do that Oh, thank God they just stupid too. Now it's halftime, man. I'm happy with this result. Tune you up against Man City at halftime in the first game of the Champions League. We can't afford to lose to Man City right now. But hopefully Sergio Ramos is okay right now. Hopefully he didn't pick up a too bad injury right now. But Messi looking tired though. Messi looking tired. I just have to sub him off. I ain't even gonna lie. I ain't even gonna lie. I might have to sub off Messi real quick. Probably not real quick, but soon sooner than later or sooner or later oh my god they're applying the pressure right now they're applying the pressure they're applying the pressure now hakimi oh oh my god they're applying the pressure man these niggas is not letting up messi passing it to mbappe mbappe passing it to neymar neymar oh straight to ederson straight to ederson man oh shit they're through they're through. Dararama saves it. Oh, he couldn't even save it. Gabriel Jesus just shoots it as if it's a shotgun. Straight up Dararama. Dararama wasn't even strong enough to save it, man. Dararama couldn't even save it, man. Oh, my God. Damn. Gabriel Jesus, man. Ooh. That was bad for us, man. Passing it now. Mbappe. See if Di Maria... Bring it back for Mbappe. Mbappe for Messi. Messi for Neymar. Oh my God. It's a corner. I'm about to sub off Messi real quick. Ooh, Messi's very, very tired. Messi's very, very tired. I'll sub off Messi for, hmm, for Axel Witzel and Verratti for Pereira. I'm gonna have to do that right now, man. Come on, we just keep on holding in possession, man. It's 2 1 up against Man City, man. Ooh, this is a tough ass game, man. Tough ass game. I haven't gonna lie to you, man. Messi's running off for Axel Vitzel. Alright. Let me do a short corner. For Di Maria. Di Maria. For Van Adam, Van Adam. For Axel Witzel. Witzel. For Mbappe. And Mbappe helps us still be in the lead as of right now, my nigga. That play from Axel Witzel. He has an assist to killing Mbappe, man. Let's look at this replay, man. Axel Witzel being pressured by Martez. Pass it to Mbappe, Mbappe just shoots it straight to Ederson and now we are up 3-1 against 
Man City in the first game of the Champions League. This nigga Axel Witzel is doing very good for us right now. He has his first goal in the Ligue 1 and not only that, has his first assist in the Champions League. 84th minute but still there's still time on the clock. Man City can come back right now. They can come back right now. So we can't, you know, psych out Man City right now. Man, we can't do that. Uh, corner kick right now. Show us what they can do. Kevin De Bruyne taking a corner. Kevin De Bruyne. Oh, Axel Vettel gets a ball back. Oh, but he doesn't really. Oh, now Rodri. Kevin De Bruyne. Oh, Iglesias. 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 Oh, shit. Oh, hits a crossbar. Hits a crossbar. Oh, my God. That was too tough. Van Adam. Seeing if Mbappe is open. Oh, my God. That's not good. Whatever. We still won the game. 3-1 beating Man City in the first game of the Champions League. This is a result that we needed. This is a well-needed result. Kian Mbappe has two goals, man. He has two goals, man. That's a good result for us, man. Damn, man. It was a tough-ass game at first, but we managed to keep on upping the score. We managed to keep on applying the pressure against Man City, man. Man. Man City is no slouch, man. Man City, I swear to God, they are no slouch, man. Now, let's do the post-match interview, man. Let's see what the fuck the reporter has to ask us right now. 3-1 against Man City. That's a good result. In the first game of the Champions League, it must be a blow. Ramos picked up a knock. That means it could be out for the next four weeks. Oh, shit. I'll say... Let's just get him back to full fitness, man. Let's just get him back to full fitness because Ramos, man, he's going to be out for a while, man. It's going to be tough, man. Mbappe's performance, as usual, man. I swear to God, every video killing Mbappe always scores, man. He always scores, man. I would say he capped off a good team display to make, you know, the team morale to go up as well. Killing Mbappe always fucking scores, man. He never disappoints. Up against Man City is a hard game to call. You must be delighted for the win. Where it was confident, I'll say every single one of the lads committed to do the job, man. You know, because Man City was no slouch, man, at first. But those three goals were more than enough to secure the win against Man City. But now, let's look at the injury, bro, from Ramos gonna be up to four weeks he sprained his injury oh oh my god i'll fix the problem myself man sergio ramos sergio ramos man he's injured for the next four weeks that doesn't really matter but let me put Kempembe for Ramos right now. Very, very tough episode, man. But what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to have to sub the next game against OL. I don't know if that will, you know, do something bad against us. I don't know if we might lose against OL. But we got to see if we can, you know, just substitute, man. Because I can't keep on playing all the games, you know what I mean? I can't keep on playing all the games. But yeah, let's see. Let's see what Idrissa Gay is saying. I've been playing really well. I'm feeling really good. I hope that means I won't be on the bench. In fact, I'll put, I'll put Idrissa Gay on the lineup against OL. Olympique, Leonais. Let me see. But I do need hmm, Idrissa Gay. Let me remove Ramos for Gay. Hmm, man, poor Sergio Ramos the next four weeks. We'll have to see, man. We'll have to see. But eh, I'll make it do that gate coming the next game. I'm gonna come in the next game. Let me just see if I can just substitute. Because remember, OL is in the top league right now. We're at fourth place. Oh my god. We just dropped down to fourth place. OL is third place, man. Let's just substitute. Let's see. Let's see if, you know, <laughs> let's see if we actually win against OL, against Olympique, Leonais. Let's see the results. And we beat them 3-1, 3-1 victory. Van Adam picked up a yellow card. 
wow man we finally actually won a game in this episode in the league a1 you know but mbappe scores neymar scores neymar scores again so this is a good a good victory and a good result against olympique leon nice but anyways man that's the end of the episode man y'all should not forget to like this video subscribe to the channel and make sure to turn that bell so that every time i upload a new video y'all should be the first ones to fuck with it and y'all should be the first ones to like it without further ado i'm big but i'm signing out peace and hey that win against olympique leonidas put up to second place that's a good result to me a good result